A current I equals 17 amps is directed along the positive x-axis and perpendicular to the magnetic field. The magnetic force per unit length of 0.16 newton meters acts on the conductor in the negative y direction. Calculate the magnitude and direction of the magnetic field in the region through which the current passes. So let me relabel this. So I have a, a current in the positive x direction, so this is I, and then I have a force in the negative y direction, this is my force per unit length. So by the right hand rule, the magnetic field should be coming out towards me in the positive z direction. Now the force on a, on a length of wire is equal to the current times the magnetic field times the length times the sine of theta. In this case it says that it's perpendicular, so sine of theta it would be the sine of 90 degrees and it equals 1, so it cancels itself out. So in order to find the magnetic field, I need to take F over I times L. In this case, the problem gives us F over L, and so it gives us this, we just got to divide that by I. So we have 0 0.16 newtons per meter, divide it by 17, and that should equal uh, 0 0.009412 uh, Tesla. Hey, thanks for watching. Make sure you check out my blog. The link is down in the about section of this video. And on the blog, you'll find cool stuff like other videos for the same chapter. And you'll also find uh, little download links where you can download calculators to uh, basically just punch in your numbers and solve these exact problems. So you won't even have to watch the video if you don't want to. The last thing I want to say is if you leave comments on YouTube, of course I will get around to responding, but I'm much faster if you leave them at the bottom of my blog, right down there. Enjoy your day.